What's up everyone, it's the Scripted Legend here, bringing you guys another YouTube video where y'all know the price of admission is to leave a like, and if you want to donate to my channel, hit that subscribe button. Now, with the trading volume being at $1 million, and when we come down, we see how much of all those other exchanges are making up of it. We see PancakeSwap has brought us a total of $1 million. We see Bitmar has brought us a total of 400,000 buy box bringing us 21,000 and L bank bringing us 69,000. If you're wondering why there's a question or caution sign with Bitmart, you can check out my previous video. But Bitmart was recently hacked over 196 million dollars worth of, of Binance uh, coins and Ethereum tokens. But if you want to find out more information on that, you can hit the title card at the top right hand corner of your screen. But let's get back into Evergrow Coin. According to Coin Market Cap and Coin Gecko, Evergrow Coin actually hit six zeros eight one yesterday. But when you look over at Poo Coin, they say they didn't even. They got close. They was like, uh, I don't want to do the math, but they was pretty close. They hit six zero seven seven, but not exactly six zeros eight one three. The current market cap of Evergrow Coin is sitting at three hundred fifty two million dollars, and the total number of holders is 109,432. Now Evergrow coin hasn't been very crazy on Twitter recently because they've released the huge launch and they're basically working on stuff right now. That's why they haven't been really tweeting nothing. But they did release a tweet yesterday at quote retweeting Crypto Rabbit for for this asking here is a recording of the last night's spaces thanks crypto newbie over on youtube our fantastic community management team along with content creators and community members do brilliant amas they are so knowledgeable and we are very grateful check this video out you will learn so much and follow these accounts so make sure y'all go i'm about to retweet it but make sure y'all go check out that account real quick man go go check out that youtube video now ever, over at evergrow coin we practice transparency right well, we're about to go look over at the transparency of Sam and the DevTune wallet. No, there's nothing wrong that they've done. We're just having some fun and looking over at how much they've received and <laughs> how much they're putting back into Evergrow Coin, just so that we also understand what they're doing behind the scenes a little bit. We see that Sam accumulated basically 11,000 BUSD. He later then sold it in in his tweet he released earlier that we've I've I've talked about. Now, I talked about in the previous video, uh, he sold it and brought back some more Evergrow coin. You can see he bought back basically 11.9 million. Well, yeah, I mean, you could say basically 12 billion Evergrow coin. So, yeah, he bought 12 billion Evergrow coin to fatten his pockets. But that's still that's still great. That's still great. And then he then later on bought some more Evergrow coin. He bought 1.7 billion Evergrow coin. Later on, he sold 1,400 BUSD, and he has been getting some more BUSD, BUSD. He did not use that. He did not transfer that BUSD into Evergrow coin, but I mean, it's his money. It's not It's not like it's Evergrow coin that he's selling. He's selling BUSD. That doesn't even affect us. And who knows what he's doing with it? He might be he, he might be at the club. He might be chilling at the parties and doing his own thing. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Or he could be using that to further the greatness of Evergrow coin. We don't know. Let him do his thing with his BUSD. I think it's pretty admirable of him to have sold 11,000 of his BUSD and then transferred it into Evergrow coin and then go on to buy even more Evergrow coin. Shows his faithfulness into the project, his transparency to the community, and him wanting to help the community by increasing the volume. Now let's come to the team dev wallet, the big juicy juicy, the big mama. <laughs> We see that they have been receiving some crazy BUSD rewards, and I've done the math. The basically they've accumulated about forty-five thousand eight hundred eighty thousand dollars, and BUSD rewards, and they have not sold it. They have. We can look over here. They have not sold it. They have not done anything with it. It's still just sitting in their accounts, and they're still. And that wallet is still accumulating BUSD as we speak. Have they? And so they have. So keep this in mind when you look at what's going on with the chart in this recovery. They have not burned or bought back any BUS, any Evergrow coin with the BUSD that the dev team wallet has received. And they're going to keep it completely anonymous to keep 
from swing to keep swing traders from coming into Evergrow coin. Now I released a vote yesterday. I didn't think I was gonna wake up to too many votes because it was later in the day, but y'all, 43 votes is crazy from y'all. One, that, so I, the vote was how long could you basically hold the dev team wallet, which is 37. 0.2 trillion EGC tokens and some of y'all was honest y'all said less than a month I don't blame you I don't blame you I understand everyone's perspective on this some people said two to six months I think that was really just three two to three people some a lot of y'all said one to five years and another a lot of y'all said I'm passing it to my kids when I die <laughs> uh, hey that's hey oh hey five and then some of y'all said five half a decade to a whole decade which is fair i think everyone's vote in their opinion is definitely valid in what they would do because 37.2 trillion uh egc tokens if you said i'll sell right now i can i completely understand and wouldn't blame you now are you going to hurt us by taking the price down drastically definitely you definitely are doing that and you're are avoiding the busd you would be rewarded but we look at the dev team wallet that thing that sucker is over 20 million dollars in volume and value <sighs> i'm sorry but some of y'all are at least selling like a trillion or like 12 trillion of those tokens bro like let's just let's just let's just be honest let's call a spade a spade come on now <laughs> But I do have more votes coming. If you want to vote, like I said, then just come on down to the community tab and vote. I'm pretty sure another vote is actually about to drop. If not, is has already been dropped. I have a couple lined up for y'all just to keep y'all, you know, active and have fun with the Evergrow Coin community and my subscribers and all. We're about to hit 800 subscribers, and I cannot wait for that moment. I cannot wait for 900. I can't wait for 810. I can't wait for 820. Let alone 901,000. Now, 1,000, I'm going to be bawling in tears, man. But thank you all for watching and supporting the channel. If, if you haven't paid the admission fee of a like and have not donated to my channel with the subscription, then please consider doing so. And chat with me down below about how you feel about the current status of Evergrow Coin. And I have, this is my test to figure out if y'all have actually watched the video all the way through. The first question is, when do you think the credit platform will be released? I ain't creating false fud out, a uh, false hype out there. I'm just, I'm just curious to see where y'all minds are at. Y'all think it's gonna be released next week, this week, or the same week as Christmas? That would be a nice little Christmas gift, you know, a nice little early Christmas gift, maybe on Christmas Eve. And I'm gonna hit y'all with spam on that Christmas Eve day when I, when that credit platform drops. There's going to be spams. <laughs> there's trust me. There's going to be compilations. There's going to be skits that I have never released. <laughs> there's going to be and those skits are crazy. And then there's going to be Evergrow Coin updates. There's going to be plenty of stuff on that platform. Question number two is, when do you think they're going to have... This is like a second moonshot buyback. But when do you guys think they're going to buy back and burn the amount of token, the amount of BUSD that they have in this in the dev team wallet? Thank you all for watching. It's the Script of Legend signing out. Y'all have a blessed one. Stay safe. Peace.